welcome to another vlog. I was sitting down doing some homework just now and I went outside to like bring the painter's water and I realized they're actually painting the house. So I thought they were just power washing but I guess they finished and now they're painting. So I'm gonna go see what is up out there. And it's very exciting because we're doing like a nice bright white on the house and it's gonna make such a difference. So let's go check it out outside. Okay, so that yellow was like the primer color, I guess. And then we have the nice bright white color for the entire house. And then the trim isn't really uh, being done yet, but this is what's going on now. I think it looks really good, nice and bright. It's actually so nice out there today. It's been cold the last couple days, so uh, I'm ready to go like lay outside and get a tan, which I can't do today, but maybe someday soon. I'm sitting here eating these frozen banana bites, which are so good. If you have a sweet tooth, kind of frozen. It's so delicious. And then, I'm making some veggies. Just, I shouldn't have put that in my mouth right now. <laughs> Just cauliflower and broccoli. And I'm gonna make some tempeh as well. This is the tempeh I use. I absolutely love tempeh. Definitely try it if you haven't. One of those foods, just kind of like tofu, that takes on the flavor of whatever you cook it in. So you can really make it taste like whatever you want. And it just has like this gritty uh, texture that I absolutely love. So I'm giving myself like like mouth, uh, mouth freeze with this banana. I shouldn't have put it in my mouth and continue talking. But anyway, painting is getting done. We're cooking up some lunch and then I have some homework to finish going to class tonight and um, that is the deal. So I'll check back in later, bye. Here is the final result. I just did some broccoli and cauliflower with some curry powder, some beans and hummus, which is like an actual addiction for me. It's so uh, bad, I do eat a lot of it, but it's okay. So I'm gonna go eat this. I'm pretty hungry right now and that's that. Hey guys, what's up? I just got out of my class, which ended up, usually it's a three hour class, and he ended up letting us go after like half an hour. So that was a nice little surprise because I wasn't really expecting to get done so early. So now I have some more uh, free time than I thought, and I think I'm gonna stop at the grocery store because I really don't have a ton of food in my, um, wow, the sun is a little cray cray. <laughs> I really don't have a ton of food in my fridge. I might get some celery because I really have been in the mood for juicing. I think I've mentioned this before too, but I'm trying to cut back on my caffeine intake. I have a really bad caffeine addiction and that is like not, not even a joke. Like I can drink three espresso shots before bed and still fall asleep just fine. So I am at a point again where I really just wanna like cut back and I don't want to be relying on it to get through my day because I it's not a pretty sight if I haven't had my coffee let's just put it that way I know juicing is probably gonna help me um, I just had one cup today so I'm really proud of myself I didn't get a second one even though I truly truly wanted to um, so we'll see how that goes. I'm gonna wean myself off slowly but surely. And I will keep doing updates on that. I love watching videos of people who have cut out caffeine and that always really inspires me to um, do it myself. I know they say it's like super acidic so once you're like, you know, in touch with your spirituality, like caffeine is just kind of a no-no. So I know I have to do it. I know it's just gonna be so much more beneficial for me in the long run and um, it has to be done. So that is on the list of uh, things to do. And yeah, so let's just go to the grocery store, get some groceries, nice healthy food. And um, yeah, I will check back in with you guys later.
Hello, I'm back from Nuggets. I got a few baggies over here. I decided tonight, I think I'm just gonna make a salad. That's kind of like my go-to, because A, I can't cook, and B, can't go wrong with a good salad. So, I also got, I haven't had this in a really long time, kombucha. I love you. Um, so, let me show you what I got really quick. First of all, I actually finally splurged and got this Hydro Flask. I've been eyeing them ever since I saw that they came in this color, which is like actually my favorite color. And I've been thinking about it for the longest time. So um, I decided tonight I'd get it. And funny story, I actually walked in and it was like displayed right in the front, that, that specific color, just one of them. So I was like, oh my God, totally meant to be. I'm taking it home. So I'm excited about my Hydro Flask. I've been using a really busted up water bottle for a while now, so. I feel deserving of a new one since I do <laughs> go to the gym pretty often. So moving on, I got some blueberries. I got mushrooms. I am a big, big uh, mushroom fan. So got those. What else do we have here? I got some delicious peppers. These I love in my salads. I probably should have bought them. <laughs> unpack this before I started filming, but hopefully this works out. So I love these peppers in my salads. I just chop them up and they work really well. I grabbed some tempeh because I just passed, I passed this and I literally um, eat tempeh almost every day. So it's just good to have. And then I got these olives, which my mom bought the other day and she left them here and I've been snacking on them. And A, I love olives. B, this mix, I don't know what they do to it, but it is so freaking amazing. So it's just called Granzella's Olive Mix. Granzella's. I don't know if that's supposed to be in there twice, but um, honestly, freaking bomb.com. And then I got some yellow squashies because I like doing this in the morning with like a tofu scramble. I got an onion because that's great for like everything, you know, salads. I got an avocado because I totally wanted to eat an avocado tonight and I have been craving it. And then I got, sorry this whole like food hauls all over the place, but I got this quinoa mix because it looked amazing and um, I thought it'd be nice to like top some of that on my salads. So yeah, that is the little little nuggets food haul. I'm gonna make myself a quick salad right now with some romaine lettuce I have, and I'm gonna be eating these while I cook. Yummy. Good morning, guys. What's going on? I am currently sitting in Starbucks parking lot. Now, this is my second coffee of the day. But in my defense, I got up at like 5 a.m. this morning to go to Orange Theory and I have a long day ahead of me. So this will be my second and most likely last. Uh, but you know, baby steps as far as this whole like caffeine cutting journey goes. So that's that. I'm actually on my way to go pick up my mom and then we're gonna go to this like wildflower field i guess it's on a mountain it's called table mountain it's in like the oroville area which is so funny because i have someone i follow on instagram she's like the cutest thing uh her name's Alyssa, and she has been posting these like wildflower not farms but like you know natural places where they have wildflowers and um that guy had cool tattoos and I asked her where it was and it was like down by San Diego, which is like six hours away from me. So I was like, damn it, I might not even be able to like make that uh, this year. I might have to wait till next year because they only, you know, bloom for a certain amount of time up until May, yada, yada. So I was talking to my mom the other day and she's like, oh, I'm going to this like to see these wildflowers. And I'm like, what are you talking about? And she was like, a wildflower field. I don't know if someone's beeping at me right now. I don't think so. No. And she was like, a wildflower field. And I'm like, oh my God, like, let me see pictures. Like, what is this about? Is this kind of like the ones that I saw on this girl's Instagram and really wanted to go to? And so I looked it up and it looks 
stunning and it looks very similar and it looks like they're all like kind of like purpley so I was so pumped and I'm like you know what I want to come visit on Friday which is today and I want to try to film some stuff now this is a whole long story of um, me filming my new YouTube intro like a while back and not getting the footage that's like a whole story but long story short I don't have footage from when I went to LA and filmed for my new YouTube intro so I need to find a way to redo it and I thought this was the perfect opportunity to try to do that so that's what I'm gonna do today I brought a couple outfits I'm wearing this like denim romper from my girlfriend's uh, boutique from last year and I thought this was a good outfit to kind of start with because um, it's just comfortable and like one piece so if I have to do an outfit change in the car it's no biggie I also brought a beautiful like flowy spring dress which I'm excited to wear and what else I brought some heels she said it was kind of busy because my mom went the other day and she said it was busy so I don't know that gets kind of tricky sometimes when you're trying to like film and like frolic around and <laughs> take footage of yourself because people are like what the fuck are you doing so and I hate being like the center of attention so we'll see how that goes uh, but that's the deal right now I'm gonna grab my Starbucks and this line is always so long in the Starbucks but it's okay because I kind of like I'm trying to get 10,000 million things on my phone done this morning and uh, sometimes you just need that <laughs> moment in the drive-thru to get shit done so that is the deal hopefully I have some beautiful footage for you of some beautiful wildflowers and we will see uh, I also have a two-hour drive ahead of me to get to my mom so I'll probably probably be listening to lots of like podcasts which I've been doing a lot lately and posting on my Instagram stories so if you're not following me on Instagram I'd love to have you there um, I've been kind of stepping out of my own oh, a squirrel literally I just got distracted by a squirrel there was a squirrel yesterday I was sitting on my school campus in the grass and this squirrel literally like came up to me and it was like hey what's up like gave no fucks <laughs> and it had really big balls or nuts if you want to be a little punny there so yeah these squirrels out here in Northern California they don't give a fuck uh, anyway what the fuck was I saying um, oh, stepping out of my comfort zone and talking more about like kind of, I don't know how to explain it. Just like talking more on Instagram. I've been kind of going over like the, I've been doing a podcast a day. So like every morning I'll kind of choose a podcast and listen to it and then give like my little takeaway and I try to keep it to like one minute on Instagram because lately I've been doing a ton of Instagram stories and they just get so freaking long. So that's the deal with that I have like a ton on my Instagram story is what I was trying to say of me talking about like different inspirational podcasts for you know young entrepreneurs or if you're on your spiritual journey um, I am like very into that stuff so I've been talking about that there so that is the deal right now I think I'll stop rambling because it's been a, <laughs> a few minutes so I will check back in soon bye guys We stopped and saw some baby horses on the way. They're so cute. Yesterday there was a horse nursing. Yeah, it was nursing. Really? Yeah, that is a quite a beautiful sight, isn't Look it? Look at the mom and baby. Right? Aww. Hey guys. I think these are beef cattle. Makes me really sad. We made it! This place is so gorgeous. These colors are just unreal. So I just changed in the back of the car into this dress and we're gonna go back to where the people are and um, where there's no fence so you can like walk around in it. You want to say hi? Hi. 
<laughs> um, so yeah, we're gonna go find a good spot to film. Thanks, Mom. So pretty. Like these cows are just chilling out here. Wow. I know the little baby. Good morning. So it's been one hell of a day. I have not yet had a minute to vlog and I'm literally trying to do this like the second I walk into this restaurant because I'm going to my friend's uh, son's birthday party and uh, these two guys are just looking at me it's so embarrassing you just gotta roll with it when you're vlogging in public you know so going to my friend's birthday party and she has like inflatable dinosaur costumes that we're gonna be wearing so that's super duper exciting and that's all for my little intro so I'm just gonna go and I'll see you soon <laughs> Easter Sunday, so if you celebrate that, uh, I hope you had a really wonderful time. I just went to the grocery store and picked up a few groceries. My mom is gonna come over with one of her friends and this was kind of like a last minute thing, but I honestly wasn't planning on doing anything today, so it'll be nice to kind of hang with her and it gave me an excuse to uh, go pick up some fun uh, groceries that I might not normally get. So I went with some like appetizers, obviously vegan, Ugh, excuse me, I've been <laughs> clearly eating them. Hold on a second, I'm gonna show you what I got. First, I grabbed these lilies because I'm like making it a thing now to just have nice, beautiful flowers on my table because it makes me happy. Oh, I hear my mom's dogs. Lanny, I hear you out there. 
I hear you out there. Hi, baby. Drake. <laughs> All right. I guess they're here. So I'll show you what I got later. Or I don't know how much I'm going to film today, but um, this will probably kind of end the vlog. I got this sauerkraut, vegan sauerkraut, obviously. Um, I got some hummus with crackers and tortilla chips and then popcorn and I have to cut this short because they're at the door. So we're gonna go get them and uh, yeah, have a good one, bye.